Hi there, I'm Jane. Welcome to my channel. This is where I'll be documenting my art journey and hopefully sharing some of my growth. This is the first video in a series of videos where I'll be sharing my art goals for the month and doing a little wrap up of what I practiced the month before. To give you some context, I'm a beginner at art. I do art as a hobby. My day job has nothing to do with art. I don't go to art school. I started two years ago on and off, um, but I've been wanting to do it more consistently. My goals now are to work on my art fundamentals, um, to be able to create illustrations, and then the big dream would be to one day get into animation. There are three different areas of art that I'm focusing on right now. Those are digital painting, oil painting, and sketching. I've been taking a 10-week digital painting course with Sin Studio since January. If you don't know, Sin Studio is a concept art school based in Montreal, and they started offering online art classes a couple years ago. In February, I worked on a couple of assignments that included a master study using a limited palette, so in this case, the Zorn palette. Um, I worked on some material studies, a landscape study, and a figure painting study as well, which you can see I didn't quite finish. In March, the course is wrapping up, so we get to work on our final project. Um, we don't have a brief for that, so we get to work on anything we want, um, so that will be pretty exciting. And then after that, at the end of the month, I have actually signed up for another course. I usually like to have a bit of a break between classes because then I get to review my notes, um, I get to sort of consolidate all the information that I learned um, in the course. But um, I follow the instructor on Instagram. His tag is at Gary Redden, and I really like um, the work he's shown there. And um, the course went 50% off, so I couldn't resist. So that's starting um, in a couple of days actually, and for March I'll just be working on assignments for that. Just a disclaimer, you'll probably be hearing me talking a lot about the art classes that I'm taking. I'm not sponsored by any of them, I just love taking art classes. Not only to get feedback from someone, but also as a way to hold me accountable um, and to stay motivated, because if you are learning art or learning anything at all really, you will probably know that it's a bit of a struggle sometimes to stay motivated. So I'm learning to oil paint with Evolve Artist. It is an online art program where they teach you the fundamentals of art, so things like values, color, edges, and oil paint is just the medium that they've chosen to teach in. So it's actually a very interesting program. It's quite unlike a lot of art classes out there. Um, firstly, because it's so structured, they have a set of assignments that everyone in the program goes through. They send you a box of materials um, before the course starts, so everyone going through the program is using the same materials, they're using the same paint, the same brushes. Um, yeah, and secondly, it's self-paced, so you don't have to submit an assignment every week. You just work on it um, as many hours as you want in a week, and then you get to upload your assignment. An instructor um, reviews it, gives you feedback, and then you get to move on to the next assignment. So even though it's a course, there's no pressure whatsoever. Um, but anyway, I'll probably do a whole video about it once I'm further into the program. So I signed up for it at the end of January. I got my box of materials in the first week of February, and in February I worked on two of the assignments. So in March, I'm hoping to get through two more assignments in block one and keep working through it. I'm actually finding it very relaxing, uh, just taking the time to mix the paints, add the oils, getting it to the right consistency, and even after, just having to wash the brushes, get them clean. It's all such a different experience from digital painting. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm enjoying it so far. To be honest, I've been neglecting sketching a bit because of all the courses that I have ongoing. And so yeah, this is probably where you'll see why I take art classes, because without them, I am a bit lost and I don't really know what to work on. In February, I did a couple of days of figuary, which is this challenge where you try to figure draw every day for the month of February. I didn't quite do that, uh, but I did a few days. And um, yeah, here you can see a couple of sketches that I did. It had actually been a while since I'd figure drawn or did any gesture drawings, so a lot of it was just spent shaking the cobwebs off. 
in March. I don't have anything too ambitious planned. I'm hoping to work through um, a couple more days of February and then figure out um, how to better structure my sketching practice for the next month. So those are my goals for March. Let me know what you're working on this month and I'll see you soon. Bye!